In this video, I'll show you how you can set up and how you can use Buy Me A Coffee so you can earn money from your your fans on YouTube or your social media following. So the first thing you need to do is head over to buymeacoffee.com. I'll leave a link to it in the description as well if you wanna check it out. So Buy Me A Coffee is very simple. You can see here you can accept donations, you can start a membership, or you can sell anything you like. And you can do this all and get it all set up with around five, within around five minutes. So once you're on the Buy Me A Coffee website, you first need to go ahead and start your page. So first you're going to need a username. So buymeacoffee.com forward slash, I'm gonna enter in my username, I'll call it KBYT123 for Knowledge Base YouTube 123. We're then gonna start my page and that should take us in to the next step where we can go ahead and sign up. Now we can sign up with an email, we can sign up with Twitter, Google, Facebook or Apple. You can choose whichever one works best for you. I'm gonna go ahead and sign in with email. So once you've done that, you're then gonna be taken to this page where you can complete your buy me a coffee page. So you can now add a photo. So I'm gonna do that real quick. We'll just add this random photo here of space. We can now enter in a name. So my name is Bradley Harrison. So I'll enter that here. You now need to choose a buy me a coffee link. Now that can only be between three and 15 characters. So if you've got a long username, you can't fit it all into 15 characters. You're gonna to have to shorten it down. So I'm just going to shorten mine to KBYT123. And there we go. Then enter something in the about section. Now you can change this later, so don't worry about finalizing anything. I'm just going to write here, hey, I make tutorial videos. Then go ahead and enter in your website or social link. For me, I'm just going to copy and paste my YouTube URL. It doesn't matter how big or small your YouTube channel is. Anyone can make a page on Buy Me A Coffee, so don't worry. Just enter in the details and then click continue. Now it should take you to the next step, which is gonna be payment. Now for payout here, you've got two different options. You've got your standard payout and you've got your instant payout via Stripe. Now your standard payout, you're going to get that paid out in a lump sum and you can request that whenever you want after that balance reaches over $20. But for the instant payout with Stripe, you're going to get paid your donations whenever they come through. So as soon as your donation comes through, if you've got it set up via Stripe, you're going to receive that donation instantly. So if you've got Stripe and you wanna go ahead and set up this instant payout, then you can use that. If not, if you don't have a Stripe account, just use standard payout and then whenever you reach $20, you can then request a withdrawal. So. Standard payout it is for me. I'm then gonna click on continue. And now here we are inside of our Buy Me A Coffee page. I'm gonna add a cover image here so it looks a bit more professional. I'm just going to upload the same image for demonstration purposes. And here it is. I'm then gonna save those changes. Okay, so now I've saved those changes. We've now got a cover image. We've now got our About Us section here. And people can now buy us a coffee. Now. If someone wanted to buy us one coffee, they would click one coffee, they would type in their message, and they could then click support and buy us a coffee. Uh, we can't do that, I can't do that currently because it's on my page and I can't donate to myself. If you go to edit page, you can also enable some stuff here. So you can type out here what you're creating, you can upload a featured image, you can embed a video, you can create a more detailed about me section, and you can change what people are buying you here. So if you don't want people to buy you a coffee and you want them to buy you a beer or pizza or a book, you can change it as well in this back end here. You can also change the theme colors and enable memberships as well. Now I've found that enabling this doesn't do anything. So if you wanted to enable memberships, you're gonna to have to do that in the settings. So if you go to the settings in the top right hand corner and then go to my account, um, you can then see here monetize. You'll have a monetize tab. You've got don donations accepted by default, you've then got memberships, extras, and a wish list, which you can also add. Memberships are gonna be similar to Patreon, so if you go to memberships, you can enable memberships and you can create them. So if you enable them here, you, you can create membership tiers. So the first one will be level one at five pounds per month. And you can choose here like what people will get, what rewards they will get for paying five pounds per month. And you can add them and you can choose them. And obviously you would make them up and choose them related to your brand and what you would want to give them for five pounds a month. Then you can also add things like extras, which are things that that somebody could book extra to 
to buying you a coffee. That could be like a Zoom call or a commission or a digital download. And then you can also add a wish list, which is going to be like an Amazon wish list. So there are a lot of ways that you can monetize with Buy Me a Coffee. It is very lucrative and it is very easy to set up. I hope that video did help you out.